Okay, in this video we're going to be taking a look at my five top Android applications. Don't forget everything, um, all the applications I review, you can find them in the description. And also, my friend is also doing his top five Android applications. His name is Techo Sticky's Glue. I'll put his name and the link to his video somewhere on the screen. So, after you finish watching this video, be sure to go over to his channel and check out his video. Um, let's get this thing started. First, um, in my top five app Android applications is Plume. Um, this is a Twitter application. This is my main Twitter application that I use. It's actually probably one of the best ones that I've tested so far. You have your tweets, mentions, messages and stuff. It just organizes it all in a list. It actually um, notifies me whenever I get a mention unlike some other um, Twitter applications that wait like hours after you've got a mention or something before it notifies you. This is a great Twitter application been using it for quite a while it's probably one of the best ones I've tested next application we're going to be taking a look at is Vidtrim um, this is a video editor but all it does is just trim uh, videos down so say for example you recorded a video but you, you don't want to show the whole video you could just take this little scroller and just only uh, have the video that you want to put in and you press that little button at the top you could um, trim the original one, which will overwrite the original clip they have saved, or create a new clip. Um, it's great if you're gonna upload it to YouTube, or you know you just don't want to keep the whole um, clip. This application is free, or you could get the paid version. The next um, application in my top five has to be um, Pulse. It's the application I use to keep up with all the latest tech news. Um, you have a little nice scrolling effect, you can scroll through the different stories posted from that website. Um, see if you want to find the story. You can just view it and just scroll across. Then you just tap here to go across to the different new stories. Uh, you could also add in different stories as well. These are all the featured stories. You could browse through different categories or you could search. Um, I also have a widget here as well so all my all my um in gadget and um, feeds just come up here so i don't need to like, jump into the application everything's on the home page the next application we'll be taking a look at um, is skyfire um it's an internet browser at the top you got the back button home bookmarks um switch between different tabs and you've got a search as well it actually runs pretty smoothly pinch to zoom works and you can double tap and it kind of um, readjusts the text and you have flash on demand so let's see if I could try find the video see that little notification if you want it there you just tap and it starts loading up you just play it it's great that um, flash works with this and it runs pretty well it's a great alternative um, internet browser if you're looking for something a little bit different works very well pages load up fast see flash works all right and the browser itself is uh, very fast to uh, load up pages like I said this is Skyfire it's free from the marketplace last application we're going to be taking a look at is power amp and um, this is a music application um, this is what it looks like when you got everything loaded up. You got the album art here, play, rewind, skip. And the cool thing about this application is the equalizer. So you could adjust the equalizer. So if you have like really expensive headphones that you really into sound, um, it's a great app, um, application to adjust it to the sound to how you want it. There's a bunch of different options. You could adjust the bass down here as well. Turn it up. Turn up the treble and the volume. Or you could just reset everything and just leave it default. Default works pretty well, but you want to adjust it just a little bit. Um, you have you can also view all your um, different songs via folder or through the library, albums, and everything. Everything still works pretty well right here. That's it for my um, top 5 Android applications. The last thing I want to show you is a little live wallpaper. It's Celtic uh, Garden live wallpaper. 
as you can see you got the water effects coming down with the light and you got the shadow coming in from the leaves it's a pretty cool we'll have wallpaper and as you turn it kind of goes with it um, it's a pretty cool um, live wallpaper it's free from the marketplace um, that's been about it for the video don't forget to go check out my um, friend's top 500 applications see if you like it um, forget his name is Teco Stickies Glue um, I'll put the link to his video somewhere on the screen and I'll also put it in the description if you like his video subscribe to um, him as well and when you're over at his channel leave like a comment saying oh we woke up brought you here or something like that um that's been about it um give the video a thumbs up um comments let me know your thoughts subscribe if you haven't already and thanks for watching